relationships with people in New York. So Africa. I'm not really like in the NJ scene because I don't think I've hung out at those locals very much. But I do feel like I have a soft spot for NJ players. Like when they're on the stream, they don't know that they don't know that I'm out here rooting for them. Uh, but yeah, I'm not sure Nanami's uh, region. Uh, I'm not either, but I, I, Nanami is, is a, uh, a Puff Fox dual main, I believe. A well, Puff Fox, you said. Yeah, and I, ah. I, I, I'm assuming Fox in the Ditto, Puff in some other matchups, because I was a little sense. bit surprised not to see the Puff. But a really solid player. Um, I, I believe 3 would my, my former roommate, Quiggles. Oh, yes, uh, Earlier Quiggles. in this bracket. Legendary individual. Um, yeah, honestly, a myth. All right, and it's looking like uh, it's looking like neutral fox is not on not on me. Uh, yeah. money is red fox. Just to clarify. True. Um, yep. It's uh, a nice a nice uh, graphical indicator. The the color behind the player is their port. So oh yeah. The name. True. You know, very subtle. Oh, thank you very much. But uh, yeah, you know, not to be taking a, a good a good little lead here. It's funny because I feel like oftentimes you think that like the the floaty player's secondary spacing is going to be a little bit crusty, but very much not the case. Yeah, just like blazing start here for... Yeah, that is just... I'm surprised that it's a secondary fox. That's interesting. Yeah, I'm uh, also, you know, a, a rectangle player. I also feel like playing the ditto with your secondary is very scary. It's just like, in, in concept, it's scary because you're kind of claiming, well, I'm better at your character than you, right? and I don't even do this full time. Though like, I'm, it's a little bit of a flex. Though, I mean, if you know that your fox is only coming out for like a matchup or two, yeah. you can just really focus in on that matchup. Yeah, that's real. But and uh, it's like paying dividends right now. Yeah. All money's got to get something started. And just when I say that, uh, I miss the tech Because well, when I think Ooh. Mott Money, Mott Money is a really fundamental, like a very like well-rounded player. But like, yeah. and, and fast, not a slow player, but not like a blindingly fast player. Yeah. And sometimes you can just get outsped in the, in the box data so, so much, right? Yeah. Um, you can also just get, you can just dink and die. Like yeah, it's oh, just gambling. It, it really, yeah. It's like first one to get a knockdown wins. Ooh. Especially in the age of reaction tech chasing. Uh, I feel like this first game might be Jover. Uh, yeah, it's I don't really know what Mott Money can find. Oh. Uh, Little let Dash PC shine into lose game one. Yeah, and a little late on uh, a little late on some grab follow-ups. Uh, a few tech chases, just getting spot dodged. Yeah, that's and unfortunate. I don't know because you can adapt either by being like, okay, let me be faster, mm -hmm. or you can adapt and be like, oh, let me go for reads. Let me not do my tech chase so much. But that's scary. It's it's scary, and, and you're leaving a lot of potential punish on the table. Yeah, absolutely. You know, like like. The uh, Fox is really good at reaction tech chasing, right? And if, you just, if, you're, if you're playing the character like knock down, tech chase, knock down, tech chase, rinse and repeat, yeah. and with some grabs in there, right, and some platforms, uh, I mean, the, the, the damage racks up so quickly. And if your opponent is doing that and you're not, you, you're just probably getting fun and scaled. Yeah, they did game one on Battlefield, right? Are yeah. We, I mean, uh, maybe we're doing the gauntlet. It, I mean, I love it. Sometimes it doesn't make it. It's just ditto, right? It's just vibes. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> maybe this is Mott's comfort stage. Uh, it makes me guess that Nami's region is New York or New England because we're such battlefield lovers. Yeah, you guys are diehards. Yeah, we're diehards. But I yeah, honestly, I'm not sure, which is uh, my mistake. Uh, Actually, everyone agreed to go battlefield new with me today. It was so oh, nice. Yeah. That's that's nice. They've really taken it easy. And I'm putting myself out there because I'm being I'm being the guy who's like, do you want to do battlefield or call me out for revealing information to you? You know? Right. And I'm always afraid they'll be like, uh, no. And then I'll be like, right. well, Let, let's strike. I've been battlefield. Yeah. So uh, everyone was nice to me, which is which is great. It doesn't happen often. I mean, there aren't too many matchups where you want to actually ban battlefield. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's true. Everybody likes it, other than like spacies because of like wall riding, I guess. Yeah, but uh, I mean, it, I, for a lot of people, it's it's just the stage people have put the most hours in, right? Yeah, exactly. I feel like most people's solo practicing like yeah. gravitates towards battlefield, so it's like. Yeah. But that's another thing you should like, you know, in theory, you should punish somebody for that. Like, oh, you only practice on battlefield, and you said you wanted to start battlefield. Right. Now I I, I have you in the palm of my hand. You know. Right. You, you don't even need the vibes. Yeah. You can just. Just, just, you know, kneecap them up right before the set starts. Oh, Mont Money, uh, Mont Money did a tournament winner there, and uh, man, like really was close to having the reins of this match, and kind of uh, did one little flood that got punished. So I'd like to see Mont Money clean the stock up quick. 
Yeah, I, I mean, it's, it it's got to be demoralizing for the. Uh, I, I like. I, I genuinely am pretty sure it's secondary spots. Uh, yeah. To just be slightly outpacing you in the in the data. I mean, maybe it's a dual main at this point. This box is looking pretty darn good. Yeah, yep. But, but nice by my money, clean it up. Uh, yeah, sir. <laughs> right. Yeah, it's also like maybe there's something to the. You know, it's like the Sheik ditto, they chain grab each other. So everyone's getting chain grabbed by Sheik, but then suddenly Sheik plays another Sheik, and they're like, oh man, this is tough, right? And it's kind of like, I feel like there's something happening along those lines in Fox dittos as well. Man, people, like, people say the dittos are, are, are whack, like yes. almost every ditto, but it, I think it's because you're looking in a mirror. Yes, I agree. You're, you're I agree. seeing the degenerate horseshit that you never actually take, like, responsibility yeah. for owning. Exactly. You need to see your character for the cheese ball scum lore they are. Right. It's like it's Sheik Dittos. It's like, yes. wait, wait, my, my character does what to people? Yeah. That's and like, I'm saying this about every character. I mean, no, we play uh, Yoshi Dittos, you know it's exactly like oh, that. Oh, it's, it's the worst. First person is pack loose. I yeah, mean, yeah, Fox yeah. Dittos feel kind of the same. It feels like a game of bloody knuckles, right? And it's like, whichever down air, whichever drill hits on top of the other one is the Yeah, winner. that's right. It, two short hop. Just short hop drills at each other, or... Oh, but Mom Money's gotten two extra chances at life here. Like, Nanami was doing a huge combo that was oh. dropped. Ah, oh, but that's it, that's it. Oh, man. Fast. Fast coverage of the ledge there. And, you know, also, if, speaking of fast, like, you just don't have as long on the clock to adapt in a in Fox, Fox Data. Yeah. Yeah, because like the the, I mean, it's decided by so few neutral interactions. So few interactions, yeah, exactly. And really just like your execution. And and it's like the the neutral, we know how the neutral goes. It's, it's one person's going to dare, and then the other person's going to dare. Yeah. And maybe if you're playing on that rectangle, some instant air goes. And that's about it. Dude, this matchup is terrifying. I mean, Mont Money was just steamrolling and did 80%, and then got hit with one shine and knocked down, and it was just like, oh. <laughs> like, is it just over, even though I did all that work? It's, I mean, that's just where Melee is now, man. Holding the corner. He will oh, just kind of nervous. Melt some people. Oh! That was nice. Yeah, that was really clean. That and then good awareness to sort of jump off stage, and then be like, okay, it went pretty low, so I'm just going to go back to the ledge, like not actually go for some low edge guard. Great little stutter there by Mott. Yeah. Slowing down the timing, baiting Mott to be the move. I love seeing that kind of stuff, man. A little bit of tasty new. See, Mott's starting to undershoot because, you know, none of his letting stuff rip. So, Mott doing a great job of, of short, like, right there, right? The yeah, Mott's really back. just kind of chilling in the corner, honestly. I think I think Mott's getting, a, like, a timing read on this. Yeah, I, oh, I agree. Nice little, little two keys there. Oh, uh, it just, just expects to call out an angle to let Right? Like, yeah. Mott has just stopped fighting first. Knows that, that uh, Nanami was, was waiting for Ariel, approaching Ariel's, and then and with punishing. And just, Making a great adjustment. Now I wonder if uh, they'll go to Battlefield the fourth game, or if Nanami will counterpick something. Like, is this is this just a mom money thing that is happening right I now? I bet you this is a mom money thing. I, I, maybe you can hold me pick it, but also Nanami won on the stage, so. Yeah, true, true. You know, David's stupid, uh, Dave's stupid rule. Still oh yeah, good point, good point, good point. They could gentlemen, but that's true. Yeah, yeah. Which I'm sure Bob would have no issue with from the, yeah, from the first three games, but. Oh, nice near into the corner to read the roll away. And now just like tons of corner pressure for Mott. Yeah, I mean, ooh, nice grab. Great Tomahawk. Another corner. <laughs> the other one. Okay. Yeah, I know. I, I really feel like Mott's just started to, to take an extra beat in that timing, and it's, it's really catching on. I, mean, I, mean, I think you're exactly hard right. time adjusting. I could never play this matchup because it feels like Mott Money has had had the reins this whole game, and uh, then he just did one side B high at 0%, and again, I'm just like, is this it? Like, it could just end again, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, it's... it's I mean, it's, it's frustrating, too, because, like, your opponent can get a read on just, like, one habit, and just you call it out half a dozen times, and it's like a game and a half. Yeah. You know? And it's also just, like, I think it seems like the, well, the Fox Ditto is, it's a lot of these long grab up-air combos, tech chases on platforms, and then it's suddenly just a shine at 20, and you're dead. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, like, nice. Mott doing, again, such a great job, these, these full hops into really late falling areas, into Tomahawks, just never to attack it on that first, that first beat. Yeah. Getting a lot harder to predict. And I feel like this is where the secondary Fox is going to have trouble. Right. It's like, okay, it's we're like, getting a little deeper into the mental stack here, and I don't know. Uh, it's like, can you adjust it? Like, yeah. That, that's, a, that's a big thing to, to change. Like, it's it, simple in, in, like, to say, but really hard to make those kinds of, those, those kinds of like, decision making, like, like, holistic changes in the moment. Yeah, absolutely agree. But let's see how that RTC goes. 
Wow, okay. A, kind of a Randy up smash that worked out. Yeah. For a pretty, you know, solid lead. Oh, Ooh. that is tough. Oh, wow, that's really stressful. This is your tournament. Your tournament. Yeah, it's not, it's not looked at in his controller, too. It's not happy. Uh, oh, now I'm kind of getting stuck on the platforms. This is just like, this is like when, it, when it's at a game scene world. And I feel like Mod was doing well out of the corner last game, and now Mod has not really even been in the corner this That's game. That's either off stage or, or losing neutral and center. Yeah, I know. I mean, Mod hasn't had an opportunity to even get situated. Like, you yeah. can't take a beat when Nanami's all over you. Yeah, ex exactly. Uh, yeah, it's... Oh my god, dude, I don't even know. I don't know what to say. Uh, like, is this doable? I mean, it's a Fox Ditto, right? Like, yeah. lots of jank. But like Mont's not, not really like a shine spiker, like no, not going no. for cheese at the ledge. No, Mont's a pretty like fundamental, like honest player. Yeah, I agree with that. And I think that that I think is that not what you be, need right now, it's buddy. It's not helping him, no. Let's get this sorted out, please. Okay, okay. Big up air. That's nice big. tech chase. I'm always impressed what Foxes can do that. They go for the up air and it doesn't hit, but they still get the tech chase. But yeah, this is really hard. You gotta protect this low percent stock very carefully. Yeah, it's it's uh, okay. Okay, that's that's big. That is big. Well, this lead is so different than it was two seconds ago. It was like a stock and a half. Now it's now it actually does feel doable. No, I I, I, I agree. As long as uh, you don't get taken for a ride here. So, yeah. Okay. Bad, bad start for Mod. Already seventy one. Yeah, basically don't get hit, bro. Yeah. Because like any straight hit's gonna lead to like a tech chase up the match or uh, a, yeah, up, yeah one up. And that shine did knock down. That was weird. Trick shot. Oh, doesn't go. <laughs> uh, he jumped in there. Yeah, he did. That's, that's, that's tough. Whew. But GG's a good, good shit to That great shot from the secondary box? Perhaps. Yeah. I'm, we're sure. going gonna to stick to it, and if I'm wrong. Yeah. Uh, yeah.